I swear, I swear, I'm ready, I'm ready to go. Uh, I'm definitely not, not late. All right, off to Boston. And we've landed. I'm gonna go meet up with my friends. Hopefully they're not too inebriated and I can actually find them in this city that I've never been to, but who knows, uh, it's all kind of up in the air this whole trip. Wow, that party was so crazy that I don't even remember it happening. It was a nuts time. All right, well I fell asleep. I'm gonna go and hang out with some guys, get some breakfast and stuff. Gotta stay fueled, hydrated, caffeinated before you go to any event like this, so I need to get my coffee on for sure. I, uh, I woke up this morning, did a little bit of editing. I actually finished a video in an hour, which is kind of nice to do, because uh, I was really stressing about not having a video for Friday this this weekend. But now it's, it's it might happen that I have a video every single day if I keep this up. So now I have to go get myself a Lyft or an Uber, go to breakfast, and uh, then go to go to PAX, play some games, meet some meet some people. It's gonna be lots of fun. Also, I'm gonna give you guys a tour of the room, but real quick, it's snowing right now. If you're on my Twitter, you would have known that already. But uh, it's it's pretty uh, pretty cold out there. Tomorrow's gonna be even colder, by the way, by like seven degrees or or more. So. Oh, cool. But anyways, do you guys want to see my room? I'll show you my room. So you got the grand entrance, you got a card on the ground, you have the mystery door that I have no idea where it leads to. You got the closet here that, you know, you think that it's just a normal closet, but you know, you go to the other side and Narnia opens up and then you're, you're in your bathroom. I don't know why that's a thing. Uh, I enjoy the quick and easy access though when you, have to go, you have to go. By the way, uh, you have yourself a nice stand-up stand shower here. Uh, it comes from the ceiling, pretty cool. And at first I thought, you know, this was a second shower, and then I realized that it's, it's the toilet. So, um, you know, very private, I guess. Got those things, uh, acoustic foam for all the yelling that probably happens in hotel rooms. Um, you know, got the lounge chair, you got my desk over here and my butt print because I've been sitting there all morning and then uh, all my office stuff. And then you can look at yourself in the mirror and tell yourself you're pretty enough for today. You can make it, you can do this. Also a uh, black mystery box and haven't opened it yet. Don't want to, I want to keep it a mystery. And then you have, of course, your overpriced snack bar. Um, but like these are like $6. Mike and Ike's, like a third of a bag of Mike and Ike's is six dollars. So I went to the store, I'm a smart guy. I bought some bread, got some uh, peanut butter and jelly. Um, you know, peanut butter, I love peanut butter. Thank you very much, I love you. Uh, don't make too many babies with the jelly. And then you have yourself a fridge full of everything that you could desire. Um, I, I put some chicken nuggets and a burrito thingy in there, even though I guess that this room does not have a microwave. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to cook those items or I'm gonna have to go to another person's hotel room and use their microwave for my dinner. Seems kind of weird, but whatever. Yeah, I'm super stoked about PAX. Um, not really looking forward to walking around in the cold if we have to go from building to building, kind of like we did at West or Prime or whatever you want to call it. Um, but it, overall it'll be fine. I have two jackets and the hoodie and this sweater, so I should be more than toasty. I, I should be fine. I'm a mountain man. I can handle it. Wild pineapple as a fear. We're not gonna storm. We're not gonna make it pex. We're gonna die out here. Boston's my grave. You gotta do the line. Do it. Have my dog. That's badass. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is my favorite camera. <laughs> oh, Everybody get a get a close up of, from below. Go, go below. 
Under the, do you want the balls too? <laughs> Whatever you can fit in there, man. It's, it's a the video. The whole thing, the whole package. Every, every bit of it. It's video. <laughs> right there. That's perfect. That's a good shot. Like, hey, do the, do the swirl face. Do the swirl face for me. Watch, Just I go. Just one swirl face, please. Let's go. I am your uh, Hold up, he can do it. Yeah. Yeah. Are you serious? Ooh. I've never bottle flipped in my life. I don't. I don't play Happy Wheels. So. You don't make Hello Neighbor bottle flip. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> Welcome to the PAX East 2017 Experience Extravaganza. Here, this is the bottle flipping booth. He's playing with himself. He won. Wow. That's a great so job. That's yes. amazing gameplay. So I might be able to see through yours. There we go. That's Max, good. Max, can you move that direction a bit? Yeah. All right. Perfect. <laughs> I can totally see it. so far. Oh, I love the part where you stand around and wait for Hoodie Panda, then stand in another area with Hoodie Panda for Hoodie Panda to walk off away from you. Oh, just what your favorite part of PAX was uh, so far of this event? Definitely the lines. The lines are great? They're, they're incredible. Best, how, do they compare, best, yeah. how do they compare to UK lines, would you say? These ones are much better. Or I guess queues, as they would say over there, right? Is that Much correct? longer. Much, much more ideal. What has been your favorite part of PAX so far? The walking and the standing. Don't forget about Hoodie Panda. And the waiting. Waiting for Hoodie Panda. Yeah, that's, hoodie been a, Panda. that's been a generally great part of the PAX uh, East event so yeah. far, is what I'm gathering from all the other yeah, creators as well, too. Yeah. All right, first day at PAX was pretty tiring. A lot of stuff to do, but also um, a lot of walking. So I mean, that just goes with the event anyways. Uh, I'm off to the grocery store again to pick up some beer, some whiskey, and uh, per request, some Pinot Grigio. Honestly, it's hard in like a city to uh, that you know all your friends and, and yourself have never been to, to really know exactly what to do, even during the daytime, but more so during the night. Um, so it's hard to do. And also we have some people that are under 21, so we can't just like go out to a bar. Like that's the simple solution, right? Just to go out to a bar. Um, I would say, like maybe like live music or something, but all right, again, Yelp only goes so far and it doesn't really tell you much, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll make it work. We'll make tonight fun and tomorrow will be really fun. Hopefully, uh, Swollen is actually having problems right now uh, with his flight. His flight has been delayed twice, so hopefully he'll still make it out. Uh, I really wanted to see him, he's a cool guy. And uh, he had plans for a Q&A with all of us, which seems pretty cool as well, so. Uh, it would be really, really disappointing and not the same trip without him, so really hoping that works out. But by the time you guys see this, it either will or won't. So don't don't worry about commenting or you know, praying praying for Saif. So but anyways, uh, my hand is cold, so I'm gonna put my glove back on. Turn left. Back. are very bloodshot that's just it just happens naturally from when I get really tired so whatever it is uh it's 2 a.m in the morning right now um so that's it's been a very long day so to to say the least uh and we also got some some bad news unfortunately our uh brother in arms swollen gamer Saif um Unfortunately, his flight got canceled, therefore he can't come to PAX and can't hang out with us all, uh, which is super unfortunate. We're going to miss him a lot. Uh, we're still going to... We, we actually plan to do a Q&A video um, with him here with his you know camera and stuff like that, but Oompaville 
brought his camera. So we're gonna use his camera. Hopefully, we're still gonna do this. I really wanna do this for him because um, he was really stoked on doing this and we, we really wanted to do it as well. We're gonna use Oompaville's camera, record here, have uh, Swollen Gamer on Skype and still do his Q&A video. If you want to see that, go check it out on his channel if we end up making it. Hopefully we will because I was really excited to do it as well. Um, I just hung out with, with Ryan, Rifty, and Oompa uh, tonight and their girlfriends as well. Well, not Rifty. So Ryan has his girlfriend here. Oompa has his girlfriend here. And I, I don't have my girlfriend here. And Rifty is uh, uh, riding solo, I guess, is the better way of putting it. So uh, we're, we're pairing up this weekend. Yeah, it's really unfortunate that uh, Swollen couldn't make it out. Uh, just weather, and I think I heard something about like an ice de-icing truck, like crashing or something on the runway. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't I haven't looked it up yet. I'm so tired right now. Uh, I have to wake up in um, about four hours so that I can edit another video and uh, go out to breakfast at a decent time before PAX. So uh, I know a lot of you guys have been texting me. I know a lot of you guys have been talking to me on Twitter saying that you guys are gonna be there on Saturday. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna try to kind of give you guys updates on where I am at PAX, like if I'm on the floor, if I'm in a lobby somewhere, if I'm at the food court. By the way, sorry if my nose seems a little bit stuffy. I think that I might be allergic to hops or something like that. Every time I drink beer, my nose gets just really stuffy for whatever reason. So um, I might have to stick to just like something else or none at all. I'm really looking forward to meeting some of you guys today. Uh, I met one dude today that recognized me that uh, it was it was funny. He he called me a celebrity. If you're watching this, you know who you are. Uh, it was it was a fun interaction. I was really glad I I got to meet you. You're, you and your friend are super cool. Um, it, it really it really tickled me that I got called a celebrity though. Like I I I literally laughed out loud. Um, not at the the guy, of course, just at the the fact that someone said me as. A as a celebrity it doesn't make sense either way thank you so much for just i don't know saying hi i mean that's like the reason why i'm out here at pax is is for the people like we spent pretty much all day just standing around like not really doing anything like i mean I i'm into some of the games that are around here on the floor of course like i want to check out stuff but honestly like the main reason I think the majority of people are out here are to meet the other people. PAX is just a reason. It's just an excuse. But anyways, guys, it is 2.01 on Saturday, March 11th in the morning. <laughs> I'm going to bed. I need to go to sleep. So good night. I will see you guys tomorrow at PAX. Until then, remember to declog your nose and to keep having fun. Bye-bye.